We've worked so hard for this and um, just all credit to the team. We stuck together there, we played for each other and um, that win just means a lot for us and the girls. We knew going into it we're going to be a tough game. We worked really hard in training leading up to the final and we just knew we had to be there for each other from minute one to minute eight. To and what was the talk at half time, only being you know, one score up? Was it quite a positive feel? It was, but we just needed to remember we were only one try in front and they were going to come out and throw so much more at us. So we just needed to stay connected and just keep digging deep. Coming into it, I think we, we had as points um, and like defence wise, we knew what we needed to do. We've been working on initial contact all week and then a scramble defence was just great in that game. So I can't fault them. Absolutely, I think it's it comes from the team and I think they've welcomed me in so easily and I felt so comfortable, it's, it's allowed me to grow and obviously being able to perform in games like this and even just being within the squad for games like this is important to me and you know we'll see what the future holds but I'm just doing everything I can with the squad of these girls. And how nice to bring Shannon out at the end for that trophy win. So important, I think that's that's what we bring as a team and it's everyone, not just the, the, the 13 on the field, it's, it's everyone involved from day one. People have a lot of respect for us and wherever you go people always say these are a really nice club. I remember when I left one of my teams and came here, the girls of the old team said, I'm really glad you're going to Leeds because they're such a nice team, they're really nice girls and that's what makes this team special. We're all just really nice people, we're all kind to each other and we all support each other and that is what gave us the win today. It's actually amazing, I, I did manage to play the 2019 one so it was on my, my tick list, I wanted to get the win here today so yeah I'm absolutely buzzing yeah. And it was one of the, it was, as one of the experienced players, was this something that a bit of onus on yourself to really you know guide the way for some of the younger younger girls in the yeah team. definitely just like giving a, the nudge to your next player just saying digging deep that's what we needed to do with it we're tough out there and we does worked hard so yeah just give him a bit of support and we've got through it and got the win how nice it was as well to have that moment with shannon at the end too yeah it was bless her um we're just hoping she has a speedy recovery but yeah glad she got to stick around because we did that for her in them final minutes. We had her in the back of our mind and yeah, hopefully she, she has a speedy recovery. There's a few, I mean, I have played all over the field, like wing, hook guy like there, not positions I'm comfortable with. In terms of like, I'm not familiar with them, I've never played them before. And playing them for the first time in the Super League's a bit, a bit more tough than usual, but half where I've always played and Lois took a chance on me because Rochi was out and there's loads of options in the team and Lois has believed in me from day one and she gave me the chance and I can't think I enough for that but I can't describe it. It's been two hell games and massive boots to fill but I couldn't be more proud of every single one of the girls. Does it really pay off the fact that, that you know we really put the effort in against St Helens in that semi-final yeah. and it was the same effort today? Yeah like we went in with the exact same game plan, our game plan works, things clicked against St Helens like that desire clicked in. Courtney said something, she said like how much do we love playing with each other and we all said like loads and she said but how much do we love playing for each other and I think that resonated with every single one of us girls out there and today that's all we did is we played for each other because when you haven't got it in the tank for yourself you've always got it in for your mate. Has it really been a long year going up to this? Oh yeah definitely, we, we lost out in the Challenge Cup and we knew that we were very disappointed, we didn't want to get into that headspace, we didn't want to feel that way that we felt in there and um, this is going to be a very, very sweet feeling tonight. For yourself, it's your first season at, at the club. Yeah. To have got to a Challenge Cup final, to have been in the chance with a Betfred yeah. you know, League Leader Shield, and now to have won a Grand Final. Yeah. You know, was it a real build-up throughout the year? Oh, 100%. And like you said, it was my first season here, so to have, have accomplished this much and be a part of the team week in, week out, it just feels amazing to know. Obviously, I came, came this season and I've just progressed myself, and then we've all progressed as a team as well. So. We seem to always do it tough, but we knew we had the belief last week against Saints, and we knew coming into this, if we performed on the day, we'd get the win, and we have. We've come out grand final winners, which is just an amazing achievement after we've been through a tough, tough season.